All right, here we go. Big Daddy Shit, day 1067. It's parked. So, um, you know, today, I, I'm, I'm not hungry. I didn't, do I even, I don't even think I drank water, okay? But the weird thing is about now is now that I'm not really stressed out about stuff or, um, you know, I mean, I took care of like a lot of the stuff and then, you know, I worked pretty hard on my, uh, you know, the, the logo for the school. It's a beaut. It's really awesome. I think. And, uh, and, uh, you know, just, 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 just that kind of stuff. So when I eat, you know, the, when I eat different things now, right? So like I, I finished eating that, that, that soup. I finished eating, uh, what else? I ate a protein bar. Oh, I ate two McRibs. <laughs> it just looked good. I just saw the thing and I'm like, okay, two for six bucks. Okay, why not, right? So, but then, you know, I did the calorie count for that day. It's like, okay, you have two McRibs, probably 500 calories each, 1,000, and you have that soup, which is, I don't know. There's no way that's like more than 500, probably like 300 who knows some rice and stuff drink the water and then uh you know i was a, it was a pretty good day but it's weird because i guess some of the choices that i'm eating right it's still keeping me like it's keeping me like at the same level all right so i don't know what happened with my metabolism on this one but i guess it's a lot different from when I was eating zero carbs. And so I think that's why that one day when I was losing weight like crazy, that week, two weeks, that it was, it was like that. But now that I'm eating, you know, more carbs, I think it's, uh, I mean, I feel more alert, right? I feel more stronger and stuff, but it's like the whole thing about like, you know, just losing weight alarming rate who knows maybe i'm just still in the ketosis not because pre-ketosis state again but uh uh what is it you know it's trial and error you learn from your mistakes i but the thing is this one i have no idea what the mistake is the mistake is probably not going inside of costco and buying like you know fruits and vegetables and just throwing down that way because i know that i'm not doing myself a favor by not eating too many salads and everything but uh, what did I eat I don't know it's like I, I'm living in one long nine month day right uh, but actually that's not true too because I'm still I still have different variations on what, what happens each day which path I take, like right now, I'm going this way instead of that way, or the other way. So, um, what is it? My my sleep habits, since I caught up on it, it did really well. So now I'm a lot more alert at night. And then, so now, I don't feel the need to stay up past a certain time because, you know, it's like, oh, I gotta finish this, I gotta finish this. It's like, it feels good. Just to when you just feel a little bit sleepy, just go to sleep. And when you wake up, so I've been waking up like uh, like about seven every day, 7.30, sometimes six. Today I woke up at five, 5.30. And then so, so it's like, you can be more productive when you eat better and you sleep better. I mean, it's common sense right it's one of those things where it's like you always know until you actually said it and you're like yeah everybody knows that so of course because it's like waking up in the morning you have a clear head you can eat breakfast and then uh, um, you know you're alert and you can finish the stuff that you could have finished at night but on a clear mind and then so that's why it's like you know I mean once upon a time I was a super big procrastinator, right? And then so wait till last minute, last minute, last minute, and then it totally sucks. 
but now as I'm getting older and wiser it's like okay now I have the rest in me and then you know I'm you know trying to eat something still go for my walks and then also I'm cleaning up stuff little by little at my place yeah I know I get it it's one of those ones where you always find an excuse it's like oh okay I'll do that later I'll do that later and thing is I realized the other day some of the stuff that I said later is like I don't know <laughs> it's been sitting there since like pandemic started you know so that's why I'm like okay I gotta I gotta I gotta fix things out so, I don't know. Uh, we'll see. Oh, this sun feels so good. Even though it's just on my eyes. It's like my friend Chalina, she's going, she's moving to Maui. I'm like, wow. That's amazing. So, I don't know, maybe I have to go visit Hawaii. Who knows? You know, I think the thing that helped out too was having an actual written checklist. You know, I used to make the mistake of like just emailing myself, right? Okay, reminder, email this, 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 right? And then you read it and nothing, right? And then you forget about it. Later on, you got to find it and you go like, oh gosh, what did I put the title? So that's the whole thing. I mean, if I have a physical thing that I write down, it's good. So you, you find out what you have to take care of. So there's no... Uh, no question on what happens. So as I'm getting older and my memory is starting to deteriorate, I don't think it's deteriorating, but it's like, uh, you know, you forget certain things. And, and so some of these things are actually really important. Some of them are not. Some of the things, you know, thank God I forgot them, right? But to be able to to, uh, you know, all your tasks, get the stuff done, find out what you have to eat, when you're going to eat, the schedule, and scheduling, and writing down important stuff, you know, that's one of the things where I had to work on, because in my mind, everything works out, it really does, but that's with everybody, I mean, everything, you know, it's all common sense once you actually do it, but, you know, if I'm going to be like super important one day, I got to make sure that my stuff is set in stone. So as technology sound as I am, I need to start organizing like I'm that person, right? Organizational skills. Yeah. There you go. Day 1067 in the books. So it's kind of funny because, you know, the whole thing about making a list and everything I'm going to do. Oh, God, why did I do that? Um, there's a, a, you know, like when my, my, my videos are all jumbled, I have no idea because I don't plan what I'm going to say in the, 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 the whole thing. But, you know, if I wrote it down, more organized, and, you know, that's what you'd expect from me. But it's like some days I don't even know what day it is. You know, I think there's this one time for like, uh, I think for like 10 days, I like said the wrong date, but, uh, uh, you know, it's all, it just comes down to, it's like a lot of the problems that I have would be so much better if I was just more organized. I mean, without the stuff, without writing down, I feel like I'm doing a really good job. Okay. But... It's not the perfect job. And, you know, in today's society, if you want to be successful, you got to have, like, the perfect job, right? So, you know, I think, I think that's more of the whole... I mean, in general, people say, oh, you got to be organized, you got to be organized, right? But they don't tell you how. What, you go buy a day planner? And people are like, what? What's a day planner? And then so I have all these things on the technology on my phone and my computer. So I should be more organized, right? And just like yesterday, when I'm finding out, you know, learning out of necessity, 
Well, I gotta do that too. Maybe I could do the thing where it give me alarm clock on my computer. It's like, hey, eat, go eat this, buy this, plan this out, you know? But gosh, living on a plan for the rest of my life, that's pretty rough. But then again, you know, there's always a plan. There's always a plan, so we gotta figure it out. So anyways, Big Daddy Shin, day 1067. I can exercise 1067 days in a row. You can exercise 1,067 days in a row. If I can do it, you can do it. I'm doing it. Uh, uh, I'll just put organize. Organize. Not organized. Organize. Okay, there we go.